it's JJ from Wondershare Filmora here to empower your inner video creator. Have you subscribed to our channel? Don't forget to subscribe so you're always updated on our next video releases. In video production, speeding up a video is known as a fast motion effect. It makes the video clip play at a faster speed than the original. Slowing down a video is known as a slow motion effect. It makes the video play at a slower speed than the original. So why should you change your video speed? Well, it's a creative decision that can make your videos more engaging. Speed up your video to make it more dramatic or funny. You can also do it to make your video shorter. For example, let's say your video shows a long step-by-step -step process and you don't want to bore your viewers with all the details. In this situation, speeding up your video makes it more engaging. You can slow down your video to give your viewers close-up details or a surreal vibe. Think about action films like The Matrix. It used a slow motion effect in its famous bullet dodging scene. Now I bet you're thinking, JJ, how do I do that for my video? No problem, I'm gonna show you two easy ways to change your speed in Filmora 10. The first method uses the speed adjustment panel. First, you'll need to have Filmora 10 installed on your computer. If you haven't done this already, click the link in the description to get started. Next, add your video files into Filmora 10. Click Import in the Media Library, select the video files you want to work on, and then add them to the program. You can drag and drop the files as well. Filmora 10 supports almost all regular video formats, such as MP4, WMV, MOV, you name it. Now drag your favorite clips to the timeline. Right-click on it and select Speed and Duration. The custom speed window will pop up. Here in the speed section, you can see a speed number. This is how fast or slow the motion effects will be in the video. One is always the original speed. 0.5 is half of the original speed and two is double the original speed. First, I'll show you how to speed up a video. Just enter a speed that is greater than one or drag the speed slider to the right and then click OK. Remember, the higher the speed number or further right you drag the speed slider, the faster the video will be. Now let's learn how to slow down a video. Enter a speed number that's less than one or drag the speed slider to the left. The lower the speed number or the further left you drag the speed slider, the slower the video will be. Of course, it's hard to visualize the speed of a video based on the speed number. Instead, view the effects of the speed changes in the preview window. Also know that whether you speed up or you slow down your video, the accompanying audio speed will change accordingly. To keep the original audio playback speed, detach the audio from the video. Just right click on your video clip and then select Detach Audio. Now you can edit the detached audio clip by double clicking it. This opens the audio window where you'll be able to fade in and out of your audio clip, adjust its pitch, remove background noise, and more. You can also completely replace the original audio with a new one. All done with your video? It's time to save and export it. Saving your video is very straightforward. Click on File and then Save Project. Then you'll need to enter the name of your project and hit Save. To export your video, click on the Export button. You'll find the options to export it locally or to a specific device. You can even export to YouTube and Vimeo directly or burn your video to a DVD. The second method to change the video speed is to use the video duration settings. It allows you to adjust the duration of the video and that results in the change in the video speed. This is especially useful when you need your video to fit within a particular length of time. Import your clip to the timeline. 
right click and then select speed and duration. The custom speed window will open. Go to the duration section and you'll see the original duration of the video. First, I'll show you how to slow down videos. All you need to do is increase the duration of the video. For example, if your video is one minute long and you want to make it slower, just enter the duration that's greater than the original duration time, such as two minutes. Now let's see how to speed up videos. Simply decrease its duration. That's all there is to it. Again, use the video preview window to ensure your video speed changes meets your needs. If everything is good to go, save your work and export it. Adjusting the speed of your video can make it more creative and entertaining. Now that you know what to do in Filmora 10, it's time to venture off and try it yourself. Let me know in the comments if you're planning to speed up your video, slow it down, or a little bit of both. It'll be really interesting to hear about the videos that you're creating, so let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on the latest camera tricks, editing tips, and filmmaking techniques. I'll see you guys next time. Keep creating. Bye. I'm going to ad-lib this editor. Just the ending. This outro. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on the latest...